Hi fellow makeup fiends and welcome to my July Glossy Box uh, 2013 UK and as you know I get two boxes and they arrived this morning. I didn't get a shipping notification but I think that's been a little bit of an error with the Glossy Box but to be honest I'd rather not receive that because then you're kind of going oh the Glossy Box is going to be coming and you're watching out for it whereas I didn't know this was going to arrive so it was a huge surprise this morning when it came and I thought that was really nice. It was like just a big surprise <laughs> and then I opened the boxes and I was just really really thrilled with the products that I got. So this is a seaside or summer sort of box. Sorry the lighting is not amazing but hopefully you should still be able to see the products. Anyway this box is a beautiful aqua teal colour and it's got starfish and I don't know, anemone? Are they anemone or coral? <laughs> I'm not really sure. But yeah, it's a really, really pretty box. Absolutely love it. Tony has already claimed one because <laughs> she likes to keep all the special edition boxes. Now, inside it comes with your usual leaflet, which it says Seaside Splash. And it's got a little bit of an article there. And then you open it up and it tells you what's in the box. Now, I open them and I never look at those because I want to be surprised when I open it. Um, inside the box, it is the same sort of aqua colour with the glossy box insignia and then inside, now these have been opened so they're not, I'm going to bore on, but it's a beautiful blue ribbon and then the wrapping paper has got the same sort of pattern as the box on it. So I'll keep the wrapping paper which I will use for gifts in the future and then I will also keep the ribbons. I've actually kept ribbons and I've got an absolute ton of them and I've just tied them all on the fan and now it's on and it's blown all these pretty coloured ribbons. It looks really cute so I found a use for them. I do like to recycle things as much as I can. So this is box number one. And there's not a huge amount in here, um, but there are two full size products, which is really good. So we'll start with the sample products first. One of them I've already actually used today. Um, and then the two small samples. So we've got two 10ml samples here. I'm going to put my glasses on. Now one of them is a sunscreen. It's by Cooler. And this is a mineral sunscreen and it's slightly tinted. Uh, it's a tinted moisturiser and it's got 30 SPF in it. So that's what it looks like. It's probably a little bit darker than um, my sort of skin tone. But when you actually rub it in, you don't even see it anyway. So it does smell a bit like sunscreen, I will admit. It's got that kind of smell. It's not too strong though. So that is cooler. And I think that's around four to five pounds in value. And the other thing is Pucker. And this is a radiance serum that you put on before you moisturise after you've washed your face. It just says apply thin there to your face and neck before moisturising. I haven't actually opened this one, so it's still sealed. Oh, and it's just a funny coloured liquid. <laughs> well, that's got a really nice smell. I like the smell of that. And it feels really silky. Yeah, that's quite nice. A little of this kind of product goes a long way though, so um, that sample will probably last quite some time. And then the next sample is Bamboo Style, that's the company, and it's called Boho Waves. It's a tousled texture mist. It's an organic bamboo and blue yucca root for sustainable style. And this is 25 mils. And it's not a full size, full size is 125 mils, but this is a really good sample size. I'm going to consult this. So they're around £5 each, the two smaller samples. So you've got about £10 in your first two samples. And then this one is 125 mils for £23. About £4. Yeah, about £4.60 for this little sample here. Um, it's got quite a nice smell to it. And I like these little bottles because they're useful to put water in afterwards and really good to put in your handbag. Um, but this is just really nice. I actually used this today. Now I <laughs> will, it says you can use it on damp or dry hair from roots to ends and shape with fingers for a loose tousled style. Now I don't actually need any sort of um, texture at the moment. Um, my hair is just really, I have naturally curly hair but I can normally keep it quite tamed. But at the moment, with this heat and humidity, there is no taming of my hair whatsoever. It's just wild. I don't know if you can see. It's just, oh dear. <laughs> so today I just thought, if I spray this on, 
then it might just like sort of set it a little bit because what I've been finding is I've been spraying my hair and then as it gets hot sometimes it like sort of fluffs up even more because <laughs> that's what happens. Um, I likened it to Monica from Friends when she goes on holiday with the guys and um, she goes somewhere, I can't remember where they go but um, her hair just totally poofs up so yeah my hair's kind of like that. So I did spray this on today, it was very lightweight, um, it feels, my hair feels a tiny touch dry but not like it doesn't leave anything crunchy in your hair it still feels nice and soft um and it has stopped it from poofing so that's really good so that's what i thought it would do for me and it's not really to add texture and it's not really to make it thicker either because uh i have very thick hair as it is um but it really just did help kind of control my hair through the day so that's quite a good thing because i have actually been using this product from number seven and this is the hair protecting spritz now I got this because of Kerry Loves Glam because um, she showed it on her video and you just shake it up because it's yellow and orange, two separate layers. Shake it up and spray your hair. I've used this every single day. It helps protect your colour and it helps protect your hair from the sun. But also I just, because I've got naturally curly hair, when you sleep on it sometimes it frizzes, it squashes the curls, it's just a nightmare. So if I spray this on a morning I just find it refreshes my style a lot because I don't actually brush my hair. That sounds absolutely horrible. <laughs> but I do brush it when I wash it and I just use a wide tooth comb but I don't brush my hair entirely through after it's dry because it's just a nightmare um so yes <laughs> that sounds awful never mind you still love me right anyway the next thing in the box is from Siate and it's a paint pot or a nail varnish um this one I think it came in three colors and this one's called pocket money which is just a lovely nude sort of pink colour. Really, really nice. I have put it on, but I put it on over an aqua colour, so it's not really worth showing you. Um, but Seattle polishes are really lovely, and the package isn't gorgeous with this little bow on. And that's a full-size product worth £9. And then the last thing is from Anatomicals. These are popping up in boxes quite a lot. And this is the Spray Misty for Me Facial Spritz. It's got a picture of Clint Eastwood on the back, very randomly. Um, it says, not Clint as in Eastwood, more mint as in peppermint and a long list of other core starring ingredients such as rose, lavender, aloe and witch hazel to leave your skin refreshed and radiant. You could say it's the spray that makes your day. <laughs> so that's quite funny. So this is actually a full size product. It's £6 and it's really really nice. Now I absolutely love facial spritzes. I've got Evian Bruma Sater, I've got MAC Charged Mineralized Water, I have got the L'Occitane Angelique Facial Mist Spray. Now I've got this. <laughs> so um, yeah, I like sprays. Um, but yeah, I love sprays to set my makeup. So I always use either Urban Decay or MAC Fix Plus. But I do love to carry a moisture spray with me because not even just the hot weather. I just like that refreshing feeling. I think it just makes your makeup kind of look a bit tired and warm through the day. And if you spray it, I think it just helps it sort of melt back together and I don't know, it makes you feel a bit more alive. Um, so I think sprays are really fantastic. And I actually used this this morning to set my makeup and it's lasted really well. So it's also a good makeup set and spray. So I love this. And the smell of it is actually quite nice it's not a super strong lavender and because it's got aloe in there and witch hazel it's also it's also like really good for your skin so i think this is really good now i would spray this on my face even if i didn't have makeup on just to give me that sort of moisturizing mist that's quite nice and refreshing so i'm going to put this one in my bag and i've got the other one on my desk um yeah absolutely love it so that's six pounds for a full size and that's it empty box but I'm really impressed with that box. I think I worked that one out as around £30. Um, this is the boring bit because my math is around 24. Yeah, it's £30 for this box, which is really good. That's a really good um, value box, I think, considering I only paid £10 for it. Um, and I just love the products. So the sunscreen um, is okay. I wouldn't normally use a tinted one, so that one's probably my least favourite item out of the box. I really enjoy using serums and yeah I, I only use them on a night time because I kind of feel it's a bit too much on a morning because um, I will put serum then moisturizer and then primer then BB cream then foundation and I think that's a step too many so serums are something that I tend to use on a night but I will use it up because I have used the other ones that they've sent me love the tousle spray fabulous love the paint the nail paint color love the facial spritz very good box now, my second box is actually slightly different. 
So we will talk about what is the same first. So what is the same is another one of these. I got the paint pot in this one. You know, I'm calling them paint pots and that's because I'm thinking of Mac, aren't I? They are called paint pots though. This one's called the Glossop. And look at that colour, it's such a beautiful summery bright coral colour. I don't have a polish quite this colour so really excited about that. Then I have another Towsel spray in this box, exactly the same. Great because I think the other one is really nice so now I've got a backup of that. Then I've got, from Cooler again, a different type of um, sunscreen. I like the sound of this one better. This is the classic sunscreen. I think it's got cucumber in it, this one. And again, it's a 30 SPF. They both say they take about 30 minutes to actually activate on your skin. Um, so it's not like you can put this on and be instantly protected. This one is white. It's just a white sunscreen. Right on the skin. Yeah, it's got a cucumber sort of smell to it, that sort of refreshing, watery sort of smell. Sinks straight in, doesn't leave any stickiness, so that's actually really nice. So I will use that. To be honest, I'm not going to use it. I'm terrible for remembering sunscreen, but I do have SPF in my foundation. But I will drop this in my handbag, um, because I think this will be really useful, even if you just to put on your chest, your necks or your shoulders when you're out and about, if you've forgotten, just quite handy. Um, and then the last thing in this box I was really excited about because technically in this box, one, two, three, I've got six items. So it's kind of like a bonus item and really they didn't have to do that. Glossy Box didn't have to put two of these items in because they could have just put one and been really, you know, quite justified in doing so. But it's really generous of them to put two in. And these are sleek pout paints and I'm really excited. Um, so those are the ones I got. I got Lava, which is this bright orange colour, and I got Pink Teeny, which is a Cerise Pink. Now these are sealed, you'll probably see better if I take off the seal. Now I love these, I've got eight other colours in the range, um, so I was really excited to get um, these two, particularly because I don't have either of these, so it was like, oh wow. Glossy Box this month again is in tune with me, because I felt like they were so in tune with me last month. Um, I got some really perfect things last month for me, um, but I love these. And these are £4.99 each, so that's like £10 worth of value, which is really great. Actually, I'll do a little swatch of each one for you, because you'll be able to see it better that way. That's them. And that is just literally a dot of each one and you got all of that out of it. You literally only need a little bit of each of this product because they're just so amazing. They're comparable to the OCC lip tars apparently. Um, like I said, I've got six of the, six of them, I've got eight of them already and I mix them together to make my own lip colours and then I've got this, which I got off eBay and then I can put the colours in. I only just recently got this so I've only actually mixed one up in here. But I was just so sick of like the waste factor because um, if you mix them up and you mix it on your hand then you have to wash off whatever's left and sometimes getting it right you do use a little bit more than you want to I mean even if it's just a few dots but sometimes you get such a nice colour you kind of don't want to throw it away you might want to wear it again so that's why I got this and that's for my pout paints so when I saw these two in there I was so thrilled because now I have these two in my collection and I only need two more now I need port and mauve over so I'll have to pick those two up and then I'll have all of them and I'll be able to mix all my own colours which I already have been doing but I just think they're lovely they're so incredibly vibrant they're lovely and creamy on the lips and they're so long lasting so I was thrilled with these in my box so in this box 25 30 around 34 pounds worth of value in this box approximately um fantastic and the value of my box has already got back in these. Um, I don't count the postage because I know I pay twelve ninety five, but I don't count the postage as my value because you pay postage so they can post it. <laughs> you know, if I was to order these, I'd pay postage for them from Sleek. Um, so I just count the ten pounds. So already ten pounds worth of value back in that. Um, but in this box, love them, love the spray, love the colour of the nail polish like this um, hairspray, I think it's great, and SPF, who couldn't do with that at the moment in Britain? So those are my July boxes, I hope you've enjoyed this video, sorry the lighting's not amazing, um, and 
yeah that's it for now so um any questions comments please leave them below thank you very much for watching as always i'm gonna love you and leave you and see you all soon bye